What's up, everybody? Uh, Jack Farr here on behalf of Box to Box Football. I'm here with James. We've just watched the second leg of Juventus Porto. Kind of blown away. We're kind of reeling from it a little bit. And I just thought, as kind of a refresher, take us back down to earth a little bit. We're going to play a little game of true or false. I got five statements for James. He's going to tell me whether he thinks the statement's going to be true or the statement's going to be false. Maybe we'll have a quick back and forth about it, but we're going to try and make this quick fire. James. Laporta is the new president of Barcelona. My statement is Messi will play for Barcelona next season. True or false? Oh, I've been clamoring for Messi to go to Barcelona, um, to, to Man City. Me too. I've been saying it's, 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 it, 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 it's going to happen, but Laporte's draw is quite big. And, and he was, when Barcelona was more successful, he was the man at the helm. I'm going to say true Messi stays. I think I think it's true as well. I think that the the more and more I think about it and Messi and his career and the way he's been in terms of wanting to stay put and being committed to the one club and his family, you know, and that, and that whole kind of thing, I know it's very important to him. Do you want to go to Manchester in December or are you more likely to either stay in Barcelona or maybe go somewhere like Paris? I think that one is probably right, even though I think you and me both want him uh, out of Barcelona. Um, Point number two, true or false? Tonight was the beginning of the end for Cristiano Ronaldo. You can interpret that in whatever way you want, by the way. <laughs> um, False, because I never bet against Cristiano Ronaldo. He proved me wrong too many times. Yeah, I can't, like, honestly, I, I can't disagree with you, but I just, there were some things I saw from, from tonight. I know we kind of talked uh, about it like this. He's, he's going to reinvent this game again. Uh, I've, I've seen that I've seen that video about a thousand times. Um, Liverpool Football Club are in trouble right now. Um, Liverpool's best way into the Champions League next year is actually not by making top four, it's by winning the competition. True or false? True. Oh. Uh, it's, 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 for me... I won't, I won't count them out. It's, it's, it's Liverpool. In Liverpool, the Champions League, if people know Liverpool's history, like a night out um, at Anfield on a Champions League night is a special, special night. And I understand that there ain't, ain't going to be fans there, but it's Liverpool. So I'm not going to I'm not gonna count them out. And even then, could Virgil van Dijk make a comeback? As long as they can get past Leipzig, and Virgil van Dijk might make a comeback then, you just never know. I saw I saw a really good, speaking of how brilliant Twitter's been tonight, I saw this brilliant tweet, and I can't remember the picture. But oh, it, was it, oh, w- 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 like, was it the word Ghost? Ghost, and, yeah, and it's the like, media team. the <laughs> media team, like, get on that treadmill, right? like, get a ball with your feet right now. Um, oh. Okay, point number four. Um, Messi obviously being a part of a Barcelona team after that first leg with PSG and Ronaldo now being knocked out Messi and Ronaldo neither of them will ever win another Champions League trophy Ooh. we're talking about the GOAT here Jack I, it's, we're talking about the GOAT here you know how much I love the GOATs they ain't, they ain't gonna win it this year they, one of them could still squeeze one more out. Either one. Depending on who Ronaldo's going to play for. If it's still Juventus, maybe. I'm going to say false. Oh, they oh, oh. they okay. still have a chance. They, I'm not going to bet against these guys. I'm, I'm going to... I take your point. Like, betting against these guys is never, ever smart. But I think I've seen enough at this point where I'm just not sure... Messi next season at Barcelona, I think, is the is is the best shot for either of them because then after that, I just I just don't know. Um, final one, um, hot off Rangers and their fifty fifth league title in Scotland, uh, ending yeah, uh, clap, clap it up, um, ending the kind of Celtic terror that's been going on in the uh, Scottish uh, Premier League. Um, <coughs> The statement is, Steven Gerrard can only be respected as a manager when we see him do something in Europe or in one of Europe's top five leagues. Um, To say he's be respected as a manager, I feel like you have to put respect on his name because winning the Scottish League, yes, if you're Celtic, we've won it the last 10 years is, is like a formality, but Rangers haven't won it in the last... 10 years. In fact, they they haven't been in the league for like five of them years, so they've had a bit of a struggle. You know, obviously them going into administration and and, and all that and, and all that type of stuff. 
you got to put some credit into his name because this is not an easy side to to like hound off and they did that um being Celtic so I, I'll definitely put some respect on his name yeah, yeah well, well, listen it's incredible achievement them winning like that one in 10 years what an achievement for him what like like what an achievement for Rangers and in fact they're also they're also doing well in Europe and that's something that Celtic have never failed to do during like even like even during their best period with Brendan Rodgers with all them accolades winning a treble treble unbeaten they were terrible in Europe. They were losing to semi-professional teams who are farmers, literally. Right. So, um, I totally saying? agree with you, and you brought up the point I was going to bring up. They're still in the Europa League, and they're fighting strong. Okay, it's not the Champions League, whatever, but, you know, lest we forget, the Europa League still has some serious names in it uh, who are... Arsenal. Oh, mate. You, you kind of joke about it, but Rangers are playing Arsenal, uh, Manchester United, uh, Milan are still in there, Roma are still in there, Shakhtar Donetsk are still in there. There's some big names there. And if, you know, the way they're playing right now, I know that when the draw came out, I, was, I wasn't hoping to, to draw Rangers. I think that's a trap game for any major team. Um, guys, let us know what you think. Uh, we've talked about Messi and Ronaldo. Uh, we've talked about Liverpool getting into the Champions League. Steven Gerrard getting his respect as manager. Disagree with any of the points that, that, that we made here, rightly or wrongly? Let us know. Drop a like on the video as well. Uh, trying to hit 200 subscribers here, um, hopefully in the next next few months um but yeah uh, any any subscribers very very helpful and uh hit the bell as well uh so you know that when we uh, post a video um but until then we will see you next time